it's not a must for you to go and have so expensive De, de, yeah, it's not a must. What's our tutor in the Then prepare a small, small something in your house. Take a nice candles up or zim a steam of kind of candles. You can, yes. The biggest mistake we make is that sometimes we only relate to romance when we are having sex. sex. Just kiss her. Akiwa kitchen. And um, um, digi digi. Good evening and hello, hello, and good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, uh, depending with where you are watching us from. It has been the month of March, and I'm telling you, you have been marching in love, and we are coming to the end of the month. What a way to end the show. Mm -hmm. Tonight, we want to talk about... Da -da -da -da. Romance in marriage. Yes, that is what we are talking about tonight. And I have an amazing guest. You know her. She has been here. Yes. Actually, in the month of March, she came here and she was talking about... Mm, you remember the story of the CD, the Somoja. It costed us to fall in love. She is right back and she's the one who will be handling the topic romance in marriage and this is Wema TV the voice of hope my name is Willy Kinyash I'm at the undisputed now Kipenda Dr. Love and we are all set for you thank you very much for your support thank you for always following us as Anteni Sana and you can follow me on Facebook Willy Kinyash um, and my page Willy Kinyash underscore couples will. You'll be able to find me there. IG, Willy Kinyash, and also Wema TV. You can follow us on all social media platforms. We'll be able to interact with you. So, karibuni sana and happy and man. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm well. Good to have you here. Yeah, nice to be back. Karibu sana. Mm -hmm. um, I'm sure the reason why you're back is because you only tend to Wema. Ah, uh, Yes. kubalika. Yes. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you for having. Maybe there are people who are um, seeing you for the first time. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you can do introduction. All right. Yes. Uh, thank you for Willie for having me. My name is Ruth Gerard. Uh, born again. I love Lord as my personal savior. I'm a wife to a guy called Gerard, and uh, together we are blessed with four children. And uh, that's the best thing can ever happen to a woman. And I thank God uh, being here for the second time. And uh, I am a psychologist by profession. That's uh, basically me. Wow. Uh -huh. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe there's someone who's wondering what to mm. Yeah? Yeah, four. What are you Yeah. Only talk about Mbwango. Adoption. Uh -uh. Yes. Uh -uh. What are you uh, By the grace of God, I'll in the way that I'm going to be able to get the strength of 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 what is romance? So, what is romance? What is what is romance in marriage? Mm -hmm. All right, uh, it's it's a good question. We can, it has a number of definition. Mm -hmm. There's that where you're not married. Mm -hmm. There's the way people define it mm -hmm. outside marriage. Mm -hmm. But there are, there is a way you can define it in marriage. Mm -hmm. So maybe I will define it tonight when you're in marriage. Mm -hmm. What is romance in marriage? Romance. Uh, it's not the touch. Maybe the young people of this age will talk about the feeling, the urge, the touch that you, wanna you want to give to your partner. Mm -hmm. 
But when it comes to marriage, it is different mm -hmm. because marriage is a journey, mm -hmm. a very long one. Mm -hmm. And uh, until we say until death do you part, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. So it is an ongoing mission mm -hmm. of making sure that your partner feels appreciated mm -hmm. all the time. Mm -hmm. It is also a lifelong uh, mission. It is a way, is, it's a period of learning. They are, both of you are students. Mm -hmm. You keep learning, you keep discovering one another. Mm -hmm. That is all you can talk about romance in marriage. Mm -hmm. It is not a place of a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. It is not a place of a lot of jokes. At mm -hmm. the moment you're married, and then the next minute you feel like you don't want to be married. Mm -hmm. It is a journey. Mm -hmm with a lot of uh, discovery, mm -hmm. with a lot of deliberately learning who you're living with, mm -hmm. deliberately or intentionally mm -hmm. discovering and observing mm -hmm. the person you're living with. Mm -hmm. Talking about learning, maybe one would ask, what am I supposed to be learning? Mm -hmm. you, what are these things that I need to know mm -hmm. from my partner? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of, the, I, I am different. There is a way I do things. There is a way I view things. Mm -hmm. Do you observe these kind of things? Do you know what I enjoy doing? Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. Do you know what are my desires? Mm -hmm. Do you know what are my dreams? Mm -hmm. Do you know what makes me feel that I am loved? Mm -hmm. If you can be able to navigate through, the, through th all those feelings that I have, and you're able to walk a journey with me, mm -hmm. there's no single step of my life that one is ahead, and the other one is behind. Mm -hmm. Now that, I would call it romance. Wow. Uh, yeah. Wow. So when, when you talk about romance, maybe now we can get to a point because you find a couple, mm -hmm. maybe they are suffering, and you mm -hmm. have heard people mm -hmm. out there say, mm -hmm. you know, my wife is not romantic, mm -hmm. my husband is not romantic. Mm -hmm. What kills romance in marriage? Uh, yeah, the question of the, the, the song or the continuity of people complaining mm -hmm. that my partner is not this, that my partner is not this, it's because we do not have so much, we've failed to pay attention. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of, uh, we are so busy mm -hmm. doing other things, mm -hmm. we've forgotten that, ah, I've actually gotten married. Sasa, umeanza kulilax. You've asked, uh, what are these things that kill marriage? I will say one is uh, maybe na kiswahili kuzoea too much of getting used to your partner uh -huh. the moment we get married mm -hmm. uh after maybe two year, year two three years mm -hmm. you start getting used to this person even how you feel about them mm -hmm. you used to it mm -hmm. even uh sometimes you talk even you say you're next to that person you don't mm -hmm. even feel anything you're sleeping with that person mm -hmm. you know you're not even feeling anything there's a lot of getting used to this person is, is that normal? It, At it's, first place, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sleeping next to someone that I say I love, mm -hmm. but I can feel nothing. It can be normal. Mm -hmm. if it can be normal if you have the, the thought of marriage to you does not really make a lot of sense. But it shouldn't be normal. You're supposed to be in love and happy with your partner at every single time. Mm -hmm. Walking a journey with your partner, when you say is it being normal, is that even if I'm sick, even if I'm going through something, you're mm -hmm. not even recognizing this fact. You're mm -hmm. not even around. You're not even observing mm -hmm. the fact that maybe I'm going through something. Mm -hmm. Maybe I am sick. Maybe even I have a, 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 an aunt or a brother. And mm -hmm. mention here that I have someone who is suffering in my family. You don't care about it. Mm -hmm. Now be it becomes normal. It shouldn't. Always being alert. Always being aware mm -hmm. that I have someone else in my life who is more important to me than myself. I mm -hmm. remember telling my husband, those who know him, um, another day, uh, some times ago, I love you so much, more than I love myself. And at that moment, he more didn't even, love you, yes, he mm -hmm. didn't even see, uh, like, it means anything. Mm -hmm. I was like, um, I was a cani, akuna vile uneza nipenda. Vile. And I told him, yes, it may just for a moment think about it. And that is how romance in marriage should be. That you are capable of loving your partner more than you love yourself. Mm -hmm. In which way? That everything else that you do in your life, as long as you're married to this person, you think about 
how is he going to you know to view these things that i'm doing are they for his benefit mm -hmm. are they going to make him sad are they going to affect our marriage mm -hmm. are they going to make us you know part ways mm -hmm. you know na always everything you th you do anything you think always thinking about uh, and what about the other person mm -hmm. that is how much you would mm -hmm. that's why I, i told my husband i love you so much than i love myself mm -hmm. because even the food i prepare I don't prepare it so that mimi nikule nishibe nikule food time yenye mimi nimeprepare nishibe. Mm. I am preparing that meal mm -hmm. in him in my mind. Mm. Nikipika hii food hivi. Exactly. Mm. Nikipika hii food hivi will he be happy? Mm -hmm. And my husband doesn't like this meal. So do I have to prepare it because I love it? Mm -hmm. You see that is the sacrifices you would make for someone you love. Mm -hmm. It is not a place where uh, you get getting used to someone at at ujui you're not even aware whether they ate or they didn't eat mm -hmm. when we talk about romance people find uh, that since we've been married and since we continue living together uh, the part of us continuing to build a relationship tunaachia watoto wale ambao wanapanga kuoana you see mm -hmm. but that is a that is a uh, an, a very crucial vital oil mm -hmm. that can keep running the marriage mm -hmm. always building mm -hmm. a relationship mm -hmm. despite the fact that you're married and you have children build a relationship something else that kills a uh, marriage and uh, romance yes. romance in marriage mm -hmm. it's a lot uh, lack of time to reflect uh, lack of time to reflect, to reflect. Mm -hmm. we are so busy running with life mm -hmm. chasing careers mm -hmm. raising children We don't have a moment where we can sit down and tuambiane where are we coming where have you come from where are where we are heading we? Where? Where, where are we, we right now mm -hmm. what are we supposed to be doing mm -hmm. what are the things that you uh, have done that you feel um ninapoteza mwelekeo what are some of the things that you feel I should correct tunayapeleka maisha ya ndoa kiududo you call it you know mbio tu we can't even breathe for a moment i say I think we are losing our way. Mm -hmm. I think we shouldn't have bought that uh, property before we do this. Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. Maybe we are telling ourselves when we get married, the life of marriage is uh tupata watoto, tuopeleke shule, tununue, mm -hmm. tufanye. You lack that moment of uh, reflecting mm -hmm. on the things that you've done mm -hmm. wrong or the things that you're supposed to do better. Yes. Something else we I can say is we do not have time for ourselves. You see naingia usiku mwingine anaingia nikitoka asubuhi ndio anaingia I've seen like in movies you see we have we are so busy Mimi time yenye ninaingia wewe ndio time yenye unatoka we do not we do not have time for ourselves mm -hmm. Can we have some time where we can say what are two leo twende I walk in the street watoto wamelala let's let's take a walk mm -hmm. let's have a date and when you talk about date maybe you can feel we don't have money mm -hmm. uchumi sahi doesn't allow us to have money it's not a must for you to go and have so expensive day. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's not a must mm -hmm. what's what to end walale then prepare a small, small something in your house utengeneza mm -hmm. candles hapo uzima steamer mkae na candles you can yes And it can start somewhere and have a romantic dinner it's not a must to was it you don't have to don't demand have to safari park uh, and, uh, uh, these big hotels let us begin somewhere tunaweza mm -hmm. mahali mm -hmm. because if we have lost our way mm -hmm. we can retrieve, retrieve our steps mm -hmm. and start somewhere mm -hmm. every journey begins with a step yes. let's start there where mm -hmm. we can afford mm -hmm. all right mm -hmm. Buy a kasoda, weka kwa glass zile zenyu za plastic kama za glass ama nini weka pale mm -hmm. kando switch mm -hmm. off the lights have a conversation mm -hmm. are you happy with the way i'm treating you mm -hmm. are you happy with the how much i'm providing in this house mm -hmm. what do you think and i can rectify mm -hmm. if we can have those moments mm -hmm. i can tell you the beauty and the romance that has died in mm -hmm. our marriages mm -hmm can be so glorious that we watoto wanasema mom na dad they can even be going to school and testifying mom na dad wetu wanapendana then the, the teachers will be asking wanapendana aje mm -hmm. because they have seen mm -hmm. the beauty that the, the parents are providing mm -hmm. in the house so where does the the kissing and uh, touching mm -hmm. and all these things comes comes in 
in in, in, in romance in marriage yes uh, never grow old mm -hmm. in loving your partner mm. all right let your children know don't say that someone told uh, told me somewhere at uh, tabia zingine you don't have to do them bele watoto don't feel ashamed that you can treat your wife even mbele watoto mm. the way your wife is passing by just just kiss her akiwa kitchen and um um digi digi akiwa pale kitchen you see let there let there, there be warmth in that house mm. it doesn't have to be during holidays that is when you're remembering ah when was the last time i really kissed my wife Valentine you may fika. Mm. When was the last time I told my wife um, Bella Watoto that I love yeah. you? You know, mm -hmm. when was the last time I bought my wife a gift uh, and took it to her at her workplace? Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to be during Valentine. Yes. You know, it can be uh, we've said that romance it's an ongoing mission. Mm -hmm. Every single day you ensure that your partner is happy mm -hmm. every single day. You mm -hmm. observe them. What are my wife loves when I do this. Mm -hmm. I don't have to wait for a holiday. I don't have to wait for for a specific day or her birthday. Mm -hmm. These things can be done every single day. Mm. In the morning, hug your wife, hug your husband, bless them. Mm. By the way, most of the time to na chabona and eh, enda salama, yeah. enda. <laughs> You're supposed even to bless them mm -hmm. before you leave the house. Mm. I am declaring blessings yes. to you mm. as you go wherever you go, whoever you will meet. Ukitutafutia, may God bless you. Mm -hmm. Hug your wife that moment. Mm -hmm. You know, those kind of gestures, mm -hmm. they, they keep us growing. They mm -hmm. keep us younger. Mm -hmm. They keep us, you know, refreshed mm -hmm. every single day. There's nothing you would want to think about all day mm -hmm. other than that person. Wow. Yeah. I, I love the way you're putting it, uh, talking about romance being an ongoing mission. Because at times the biggest mistake we make is that sometimes we only relate to romance when we are having sex. sex yeah. That is the time many people, and I know many of, many of you can bear me witness, we think about romance when you are talking about sex. And you but know, it is a no, you have said it is it's an, an ongoing, ongoing mission. mission. And it's a bad thought. It mm. is a bad thought mm. to think about that when my husband touches me, the only thing that will come to my mind in it, sasa uyu ananitaka. You can have, you can even sleep next to this person all night naked and don't have sex. Yes. That's the romance. Mm -hmm. You want to feel the touch, you want to feel the warmth and the breath of that person. It doesn't have to resort to sex. Yes. No, mm -hmm. it is that touch that makes you feel, I am so vulnerable to this person. I am mm -hmm. so important to this person. Mm -hmm. I cannot... I feel the whole world. Mm -hmm. I do not even know if there is anyone else exist. Mm -hmm. I have this person in my life who cares so much about me. It doesn't have to to ring a bell that it is all about sex. Mm -hmm. And that is where we talk, we, you, I was saying it is good that you've said in marriage. Yes. Because there are other lines of mm -hmm. life where romance mm -hmm. occurs to only being a sex tool. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Which is sad. Which is very sad mm. and misleading. Mm. And that's why you find uh, many of uh, young people in 21st century mm -hmm. because of the thought that uh, this guy, how he, ki how he touches me, I think this is the right person to marry. Mm. And when you get married, akikasirika, akichukua kisu, unajuliza uninani. Yes. You know, do you, because this is a human being, mm. do you know how they relate to anger? Do you know how they relate to hang, eh, anger? Ya kukasirika na nja, akisikia nja ya tumbo. Anger, anger eh, anger. Yes. <laughs> do you know how do this person relate to these kind of issues? Wow. So when we, it is good to define something and define it well. Mm. Where you want to go. Mm -hmm. Define yourself. Where do you want to go? Mm. All right. Where are you right now? Yes. So you get a clear understanding mm. of it. Mm -hmm. Maybe there's someone out there watching us and wondering what is the importance of romance in marriage and I want you to think about that and as you, we come back we'll be talking about that. Yes, and this is Couples Wheel Show and this is where we write down our love with, when we are alive or we don't want our love story to be read when we are six feet under, neither do we want our love story to be read when we are gone. And where else can you get such a show? It is on, on Wema TV, the voice of hope. And tonight we are talking about romance 
in marriage. And you have seen or you have said that romance in marriage it's an ongoing mission. And so when you hear the word romance, don't just think about sex. It should be kind of a way of lifestyle that a spouse should live. And I am hosting Ruth Gerard. Let's continue mm -hmm. learning more. Mm -hmm. So what is the importance mm -hmm. of romance in marriage? Uh, uh, I am a mother. Mm -hmm. All right. I am a mother. And um, one thing I will say to any family that has children, mm -hmm. it is so, it's, it's so healthy for those children. There's, there's an element of fear, mm -hmm. disappointment, and self-confidence, self-awareness uh, that it gives even children when they are out there. Wakati mm kuna -hmm. peace in the house. Mm -hmm. Those children, your, your children are so peaceful, mm -hmm. are so happy. Mm -hmm. That is one thing I love about even health. Afya mm -hmm. mm -hmm. When there is peace and there is a lot of romance in that house, mm -hmm. there is a lot of understanding, there mm -hmm. is a lot of care mm -hmm. in that house, there is good health. Mm -hmm. Mutakuwa mna gonjeka tu homa yenye inaletwa na seasons za baridi na za jua. Hii magonjwa mengine? You will not be sick. Wow. Hakuna kugonjeka ugonjwa yenye ina it's unnecessary. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you find we are getting so sick because my wife is, is not talking to me. Mhm. Mm Nilitoka asubuhi, I came back in the after I don't know what made her angry. Mhm. Mm when I left in the morning, she was okay. Yes. But during the day, I wasn't around. But I've come back. Sasa hiyo ni stress. Mm -hmm. uh, this guy is tired, want to sleep. But hajui ni nini nasumbua familia yake. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. there is an issue that we don't have something in the house. Mm -hmm. We are like, we may be in short of cash or something. Mm -hmm. There is a way you, you we address such issues, especially women. Mm -hmm. There is a way you address your husband when they are, you feel like, Kuna kitu tu ina miss. Like, mm. let's say for mm. finances. Mm. If you can address, you, you can address your husband in a loving and kind and peaceful way. Mm. Is a person kumalizi, mm. If there is a lot of understanding, mm -hmm. humility, mm. calmness, mm. the growth that we see in your family, mm -hmm. people will just be looking at your family and they're like, I just desire that kind of a home yes. because they are healthy. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't find them in the hospital. Because we have understood mm -hmm. the need mm -hmm. of being there for one another, mm -hmm. of caring for one another. And it is an intentional journey. Mm -hmm. You have to be intentional about it. You have to be deliberate, mm -hmm. to be alert. Mm -hmm. What is surrounding your wife? What are their, her friends saying? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, is she keeping companies that really can affect her? You know, is mm -hmm. my husband working with people who can really build her? Mm -hmm. You know everything that relates to your partner. Mm -hmm. That way, that marriage can be very successful. Mm -hmm. That romance can never go. You get, sometimes when I'm are we missing something? Mm -hmm. Did you, when was the last time you told me that you love me? Yeah. I think I was tired, I am sorry, mm -hmm. uh, I still love you. Mm -hmm. You say, how do you know that kuna kitu ira miss? Mm -hmm. If you don't, make it a routine. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Make it a routine to to care. Make it a routine to 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 spare some time to go for a walk. Make it a routine to communicate, mm -hmm. not order around. Mm -hmm. And you know there is a difference between uh, communicating mm -hmm. and ordering mm -hmm. and receiving reports. The kunastima school fees There is a mm -hmm. difference between between mm -hmm. that and how was your day. Is there anything that you need? Mm -hmm. uh, did you meet anyone who uh, upset you today? Yes. How was your work? Mm -hmm. That is communicating. And after communicating, now bring the result, bring mm -hmm. the report. Mm -hmm. And by the way, mm -hmm. the landlord was here. And by the way, the mm -hmm. school fees balances, you know, yeah. need to be paid. Mm -hmm. That kind of a routine. Mm -hmm. Even if you want to change it, mm -hmm. you feel that it is not the right way to go. Mm -hmm. You feel that... Uh, because you've made it a routine. Mm -hmm. A routine whereby, the, a routine of behavior, not a routine of uh, circumstances that I do to in a lazimu, mm -hmm. let me do it. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. because I have, I have no choice, let mm -hmm. me do it. No, let it be a lifestyle for you. Mm -hmm. That you can be able to observe that if it is even the house choices, 
Hakuna mahali tulipokuwa we were getting uh, ourselves into marriage and family. No we were, were we told that responsibility ya wa, or your wife is only to cook. Mm. The husband cannot cook. What mm. if I go to the hospital? Mm -hmm. Will you be able to cook to, uh, for mm. children? Mm -hmm. All right? Mm. Or the, even before you got married, who was cooking who, for you? Exactly. <laughs> who was cooking your meals? Uh -huh. Who was uh, who was cleaning your house? Yes. All right? Mm. If I travel today, mm. uh, for instance, there was a time I traveled. Mm -hmm. And um, I made sure that that day that I traveled, mm -hmm. I prepared lunch for my husband. Mm -hmm. So this one that I took job, uh, I packed it a hot dish. Mm -hmm. He ate very well and took the hot dish back to the house. I traveled for two weeks. <laughs> and I was like, uh -uh, this is not fair. Yes. Who was to come and clean that dish? Uh -huh. uh, what if um, I wasn't to come back for the next one month? Yes. So that dish in a couple, that mm. was not, that, for me that was rude. For mm. me that was um, a behavior that I wouldn't want ever again mm. to repeat itself. Mm. And we just had to sit down and tell him, uh, my friend, mm -hmm. this is, why, why, who am I in your life? You see? So mm -hmm. the men who are doing such things, um, they are not showing romance <laughs> to their spouses. They are getting used to their wives. Mm -hmm. This is my. This is not my responsibility. And so, when you get used to your wife, mm -hmm. then romance will be. It definitely will die. If I see you repeating that mistake twice or thrice, mm -hmm. I will just keep. I will ask myself, who am I mm -hmm. in your life? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Am I a tool? Mm -hmm. Am I I'm a washing machine? Or do I do you do you value me? Mm, mm. Which value do I add into your life? Yes. If I if I if today I don't exist, mm -hmm. will you be able to continue living? Or will it be like um, uh, that person was just passing by? Mm -hmm. You know. Mm -hmm. Today people ask uh, if there is true love. Mm -hmm. There is mm -hmm. that if this person is not in my life, mm -hmm. I cannot be able to. I I can st I can be stuck. Mm -hmm. That's how much you should uh, always remember mm -hmm. that the need of romance, the need of care, the need of attention, mm -hmm. the need of growth mm -hmm. comes as a responsibility. As long as mm -hmm. we, both of us, have carried this marriage 100%. I own this marriage. 100%. 100%. There's nothing like 50-50. No. It is 100%, own it. 100%. He came to me and asked me to be his wife, all right? Mm -hmm. Kama siku anataka nigesema staki. But why did I say yes? Because I wanted to have a family. Mm. So from the moment you become someone's partner, own it a hundred percent. Don't have a confrontation or a, or a conflict in the house and then una, una fura the whole, una fura for days waiting mm. for the other, waiting like wives. We do wait for the husbands to come and you know, to bembeleze zena to rudi because we have this mindset that since ye and ye alikuja kuniuliza kwanza ni kue bibiake, he should always be the one to come and, you know, apologize, apologize or something. Or something. Yeah. Mm. On the marriage, a hundred percent. You can as well reach out to me. This was not right. Can mm. we fix it so that we move forward? Mm. That is part of romance. Wow. I I'm told that our time is almost yes. up. Mm -hmm. But we need, we need to get this. Maybe there's someone who is watching and uh, he's saying, yes, I understand what is romance. Now, Mm -hmm. In my family, mm -hmm. this thing or this giant you're calling romance, uh, it has uh, been lost. Uh, How can I revive romance in mm -hmm. my marriage? Uh, I've just said, uh, in, my, in my marriage or in your marriage, it's a 100% ownership. Mm. We ca you can always begin that conversation. Mm. Let us build, look for an environment that is so conducive to have this kind of a conversation. Mm. Most of the time you find it, eh, when we are missing something, the way we address it actually creates more problems. You know, mm -hmm. it in a letter volcano in a funguka na ina ina burst to vizuri sana. Mm -hmm. You look for an environment that is so conducive for you to talk about everything that you feel in your heart, mm -hmm. because we are we we are allowed to express our uh, our opinion. Mm -hmm. All right, sit down with your partner. 
We've talked about communication. Communication is not ordering. Look for some uh, environment, sit your partner down. When they are happy, they, we are not always angry. Mm. We are not always uh, frowning. Mm. Mm. In a moment mm. too, we are happy. Mm. That moment, mm. look for that time. Mm -hmm. Sit down with your partner and tell them, by the way, this car behavior, mm. I don't like it. If we can, can you try to adjust and walk a journey with these people? There's, there's also another problem. When I tell you that I'm going through something, like for instance, I tell you a small, like I'm having a headache. Mm -hmm. And they are, oh, mm -hmm. I say, every, everything in your marriage should be very sensitive. Mm -hmm. Walk a journey with mm -hmm. your partner. Mm -hmm. Are you having a headache? Uh, you can you take a rest? Have you, is it that you're tired? Is it that you've missed something? Have you taken water? Walk a you know, tembea na uyo mtu. That way you can revive so much care mm. that you, you never thought that this person has for you. Mm. All right? Mm. There's also something we can call uh, bu uh, the building uh, teamwork. Mm -hmm. A lot of teamwork. Mm. Create an environment where you don't have to be told. Mm. You know? Mm. Today you can decide I'm the one who's doing the dishes. I'm the one who's doing the meals. Man, are you hearing? Are you listening? It is not a, a culture yetu mwanaume mm haingi -hmm. jikoni. Some of these things zimepito na wakati. It is deliberately for you. If you own your marriage a hundred percent, you will do anything in your position to reveal, to, to revive it, to build it. You don't have to wait until ile siku wataniongelesha nivonta mwambia shida zangu. You keep, uh, that, if that is the mindset, we will keep piling issues Piling. Na ile siku zitafunguka mtu tunifu, you just walk out of that door, never to come back. Let us take one thing at a time. This is affecting our marriage. Before we go to the next chapter, let's deal with this. Mm -hmm. Alright? Mm -hmm. Then we can be able to open another chapter. Mm -hmm. That way you find even in a near, you, you can ask, you can even count the many times, the number of times you have had a, an argument. Yeah. True. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. wow. Thank you so much for coming You're and welcome. thank you for releasing such uh, wisdom mm -hmm. and knowledge to us. We really appreciate And uh, maybe you can uh, give us your parting shot. Uh, all right. Uh, romance in marriage, it's a good thing. It's one of those pillars that we cannot go uh, a mile without. Marriage is beautiful. Uh, marriage is a journey. And uh, all we need is our commitment. Be committed to your wife. Be committed to your husband. When we keep on listening to what the world is offering, we will lose the track. We will lose our meaning. So find your own maths. You know, do your own maths to bring chemistry in your own home. Wow. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you and for uh, having me. Carry our love as um, we go back home. Yeah. As Gerard, of course. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank mm -hmm. you very much. Thank you for having me. Wow. Yes. That is it. We come to the end of tonight's show. And you are talking about romance in marriage. What is your take home? For me, my take home, romance in marriage, it's an ongoing mission. Period. Ongoing mission. Yeah. What is your take home? Kindly leave a comment. Let us know what you have learned tonight as we were having this discussion this is couples will show and this is where we write down our love with when we are alive for we don't want our love story to be read when we are six feet under my name is willy kinyash and this is weber tv the voice of hope for now it is a good night god bless you and god bless you marriage and your relationship see you on friday as we get into the month of april and remember coming friday friday it is fast don't be fooled good night